What is the Rebbe's position on birth control? Really not my department. Really, really not my department. Here's what I want to say. Asking a question, what is the Rebbe's opinion on birth control, is no different than asking the question, what is the Rebbe's opinion on heart surgery? What is the Rebbe's opinion on uh, any kind of medication? And of course, the answer to all of these questions is, these are tools that exist and have a purpose and a place under the right conditions. Birth control is not a way of life. Birth control is not a philosophy. It's a tool. And when you ask the question, what is the Rebbe's opinion on birth control? The answer to that question is, there's a time and a place to use this tool. Period. That's the answer to the question. If you asked me, what's the Rebbe's opinion on family planning? If you asked me the question, what is the Rebbe's opinion on limiting the number of the children that we have. Those are questions that the Rebbe answers very directly. And of course, the Rebbe's approach to these things is that a person has to be healthy and a person has to take care of themselves, the person has to be able to manage their lives. But within those parameters, we trust Hashem. If Hashem wants to give us another child, that itself is the proof that we're physically able to bring another child into this world and we don't plan our family or not have another child for reasons of convenience or reasons that have to do with not wanting to be different than other people or reasons that have to do with ultimately secondary things. Birth control is the tool that a person uses when they're ill, for example, where they're not allowed to get pregnant, for example, or all kinds of other scenarios like that. But birth control is not an entity unto itself. Being married is, having children is, and there's a time and a place for birth control. I think that's the correct answer to the question. And of course, when a person is in a situation where they're married, and for whatever reasons they have questions about having children, so then you speak to a Rav, you speak to a Mashpia, you speak to a counselor, and you figure out how to best arrange it. And when there's a time and a place and a need for it, you use this tool the way you would use any other tool. But it's not something that has an inherent place in our world. In other words, it's not... I don't have children until I choose to have children. That's not the paradigm. That's not the approach. This answer took less than three minutes, but that's all I got. <laughs> Just to repeat it one more time, in case it wasn't clear, birth control is a tool. Tools are used when they're needed. And when they're not needed, they're not used. Period.